The importance of a steady environment. Okay, so background noise and studying. First, you must find a place where you can study and actually get studying done. Background noise can be very distracting as well as stop a student from studying. Point number two, quality study light. Lighting is very important for studying. You must have a great light source for studying. A room with a great light source can affect the environment and the mood. Climate and control. The ability to have climate control can also help a student's ability to study. If it is too hot or if it is too cold, this could prevent the student from studying at all. Now, if my partners were here, the young lady would be doing the um, pros. I don't know what her pro card says, so I know what my cons say, so here we go. The library. Just pretend she's doing her pros. And here's the cons. Not all students respect the rules. In other words, some students come to the library and they talk. And sometimes the library itself can be a distraction. And by that I mean, if the student is like really into reading books, they may not want to read the book that's in front of them. They may want to explore and read everything else but the book that's in front of them. Starbucks. Starbucks. The co Starbucks isn't constantly silent, okay? A lot of side stream activities going on that can take the student out of their study zone or their frame of mind. Home. The con for home. Simple. The main distraction at home is the family activities in the household. The second thing is that the temptation to slack off is real and more than likely to happen because there's no place like home. Thank you. Nailed it, Governor!